hello everyone so in this episode of our action rpg with gameplay ability system series i'm going to address a particular problem if you try to do this series in 5.4 i started this series with 5.3 so but some people have tried with 5.4 and you will encounter this issue gameplay abilities are not replicated to simulated proxies and therefore net multi cast functions in gameplay when multicast is meaningless so if you try to have any rpc based multi uh, replication uh, event replicated events in gameplay abilities you will have this as uh, error an error similar to this and this is what we are going to solve in this episode and before we get started i'd like to remind you you can download the project files of this project and all other thousands of projects that i have done in my channel from the patreon page once you become a member you can download anything without a limit so this is a part of this action rpg with gameplay ability system series i'm doing so i'll leave the link to the full playlist in the description below so you can watch all of them if you like in my channel for free and here even though i show how to update the project to 5.4 version i would still continue the 5.3 version in a way that is it's compatible with both 5.3 and 5.4 so that the, it would be useful for more people a wider audience so yeah let's get into today's episode All right, so here is the project 5.3 project and let's switch on real engine version 5.4 okay it's generating the project files let's give it a second all right projects generated project files generated let's open the project I don't think we will have to open the solution and generate from it here uh, build from it here it should be fine all right the following modules are missing now built with a different engine version uh, would you like to rebuild them now yes okay it looks like uh, building successful now it's opening the project okay so now let me just uh, play this in play this is standalone and it should work without any issue let me just go here and start fighting and let's wait for an enemy to make attack so yeah they can attack me so it is basically working but here let's change this to play as client so in this case i think it does not work let's see oh it is okay but yeah it is working so anyhow there should be an error under here if i try to compile gameplay abilities are not replicated to simulated proxies and therefore net multicast function execute queue and send gameplay event multiclass is meaningless so this is the main issue that i want to tackle today so now if i try to play now i get the error okay so to fix this this uh, send gameplay event multicast is implemented in the parent which is gslm here you can see the parent of the attack sword which is gslm so here i have this send gameplay event multicast so this is what we need to fix so as it says here gameplay abilities are not replicated to simulator proxies so instead of having this function here i will set up the replicated part in 
let me copy this in the character itself because from here we can access character like this get our actor and here if i have an interface event we could call it instead of calling these so let me open the base character pp third person character base but if you don't have the base character whatever the character that you are using in the game you can implement it so whatever the character who would be even access as the avatar actor here so here under class settings and implemented interfaces you can see three interfaces but i think i would like to implement a new interface for this gameplay abilities specific functions so blueprint interface i'll call it ppi gameplay abilities or i'll call it ability system to prevent any potential conflicts with built-in interfaces related to gameplay abilities so this one i'll name it send gameplay event replicated okay and just like here i will define three uh, input parameters actor and gameplay tag structure and payload game uh, play event data structure so actor actor the one event tag gameplay tag structure gameplay tag okay and the other one is payload it should be in the type gameplay event data right I still I get the errors well, that's fine we will soon get rid of them so now let's go to the character and implement ppi ability system okay and then i'll also add a category here ability system oh ability system okay no let's go back here interface all right so here i copied these two functions let me copy again but we need to copy this first and then this because this function is this event is using this event so that's why i had to copy the other one first right and then here has authority switch if we do have the authority we can call send game send game play event multicast same parameters if we are remote 
send gameplay event server and as we have copied the event from our GACLM ability base ability this execute on server and multicast multicast is already enabled okay now we can use this event instead of all these let me delete them and get our director from actor info same game play event replicated through the ability system interface like this compile we still have one more this is execute Q this event so we need to do the same thing for this event as well but for now just to prevent this error I'll make this not multicast so we will not have the error but it's, we need to do the same thing I just need to test okay now let's see and yeah I get hit so everything is working as expected that's all I wanted to do in this episode so I think we can stop this episode right here so this should work properly in a multiplayer game as well because we were playing as the client and it already worked as the player so yeah thanks for watching as always updated project files will be available for the download in the patreon page link would be in the description below and see you in the next episode also feel free to let me know what you guys think and what else i should cover in this series and goodbye